Our next guest is the hottest new singer. Even your grandfather knows him who lives in a small farm in Quebec, Trey Mitchell. He's not that cool. Yeah, it's good to see you too. But even better, it's good to see me. You've just won your third award. You have endorsements. What's next for you? Well, I need a bigger penthouse. Uh, maybe a new yacht. Yeah. And then do something simple, like run for president. The entire universe loves you, you know. You can do no wrong. Yeah, of course everyone loves me. Who doesn't? What? Nothing. You made a face. No, I didn't. You're still doing it. Do you like high school or college more? That's a very weird way to change the subject. Fine. That guy online made another video about you, and it's brutal. What? Welcome back, my true loyal followers. Who are we going to talk about today? Hmm, who are we going to hate on? Oh, that's right. Trey McShay. This is his little egotistical head, and that's me squishing it. If you truly like this man, you do not know music, and you're pretty much a moron. Wake up. He's a terrible person, and he should not be famous. He is so stinking stupid. I am not egotistical. What is this guy even saying about me? And these comments. Trey uses too much auto-tune? He doesn't know anything about guitars? Why is Trey afraid of bridges? Because he doesn't know how to write one. Oh my gosh. He's stealing my fans away. Good job. But I'm Trey. I can get them right back. I have to get my fans back. Less fans means less success. I just have to sit here. And waits. An idea will come to me, it always does. Aha! I got it. I will let one huge fan hang out with me for one entire day. That's never been done before. And my fans will see that I care about them, that I'm a good person, and I'm a good freaking singer. Good idea. Uh, who are you? I let my sister stay with me when she was sick. Bad idea. Yeah, I gotta go. Welcome back to WTV Morning News. Instead of climate change or politics, we're gonna talk about celebrities. That's always more important apparently. Trey McShay has finally chosen one fan to hang out with for a day. It's never been done before. We'll see how it goes. But who is this lucky person? Stay tuned. <laughs> this is very nice. Hey there. Whoa. You're Danny from that boy band in the 90s. You've noticed. Thank you. But then boy bands just went away. And so did you. For a very long time. You still look good though. You still look good. Yeah, I'm aware. Thank you. Hey, do you know when Trey is coming? Oop. Sorry. Mr. Trey. We're not there yet. Just take the elevator to floor one. Hundred. Floor 100. Okay. Nice design. I like the colors. I don't. Do you do music too? Let me guess. Rock and roll. Breakup songs. Ah. Yeah. I don't know anything about that, but cool. Well. This is me. Goodbye. Are you leaving me too? Uh, no. Not like that. I just... I'm just leaving the elevator. So you're gonna leave me just like that? Yeah, my next song. I think, I think you've had way too many breakups. I'm just gonna go now. These comments just keep coming and coming. Oh, he's here. I gotta go. Time to put on a fake happy smile. Ugh. No way, it's really you. Yeah, it's me. Let's get this over with. So what do you like? Seafood, the park, cage fighting, chess? Hmm, what do I like? What do I like? What do I like? 
Hey, I got it. Why don't you take my limo and go see a movie? My treat. Without you? Yeah. I'm not going to a movie with you. That's weird. Oh. But I'll ride with you in the limo. How about that? No way. I've never been in a limo before. Yeah, you live a very sad life. By the way, how old are you again? Oh, I'm in my 20s. Oh my gosh, look up there. Hey, when will I get cool glasses like that? Oh, sorry. This is my only pair. But I can pick you up something. Ha, huh, what do you think? Uh, not what I had in mind, but thank you. Cool. Alright, almost there. Yeah, yeah, it's me, it's me. You are in the presence of greatness, but I don't want any autograph. Who are you? What the- what? I'm Trey. You know me. Are you some kind of aspiring rapper? Aha. You're in that stupid infomercial I keep seeing. No, I'm not in an infomercial. God, just let my friend in this movie, please. He needs to buy a ticket. Ha, huh, that's cute. Listen, I'm a famous singer, alright? Whatever I say goes. I shouldn't have to pay for anything. Ooh, you're a singer. I don't give a flying goldfish if you saved my dad's life in a burning house. Buy. A. Ticket. Or should I sing it? I'll give you a thousand bucks. Wait. You'll give me a thousand dollars, but won't pay ten dollars for a movie? You stupid celebrity. What? What did you just call me? Just pay the ten smackaroos. Yeah, fine, I'll pay it. Stupid. Alright, now that's the last time. Alright, I paid for your movie, and you can take my limo. You can uh, tell the driver to take you anywhere you want to go, alright? But I'm going back home. Oh, alright, cool, I guess. As long as I got to meet you. Have a good day, commoner. Celebrity. Hey, I have the power to ruin your whole life with one post. <laughs> this movie's hilarious. Who's with me? Hello? Nobody? Just me? Got it. Hey there. Oh, hey. That's your limo outside, right? Well, I, uh, you know, I, I guess so. Ew. Oh, no. Just look at the screen. Dude, I cannot believe Trey is in my car right now. Yeah, don't talk to me. You know I sing too. Yeah, well, we all have hobbies. Can I uh, sing you a song? I'm gonna sing you a song. Uh, no, no, please don't. Having a picnic with my girl, a strawberry swirl with a jubilee. I'm sitting under a tree, almost got stung by a bee of love. I want to go home. Hey, she said the same thing when I sang this to her. Hey man, I'm glad you're back. Yeah, whatever. Would you please take off the glasses? I like them. Where are we going now? You'll see soon. <clears throat> Best day ever. Good afternoon, Trey. Why do I smell a person with no money? Hi. Today, I'm going to be wearing expensive clothes like a celebrity. That's right. I'm stuck with him. Please just do it. Okay, but the no money smell is vulgar. It burns the hair in my nose. How do I look? That's the movie star. Whoa, I feel so important. What's next? Really? I call that one the diner, boy. Very funny. I want my eggs scrambled with a side of grits. And go easy on the cheese. Ha, ah, I'm just joking. Okay, good. No, seriously, I'm hungry. Okay, I think you had your fun. We should be going now. Come back soon. Oh, can I keep the movie star outfit? I'd show you the price, but I think you would faint. Whew, thanks for meeting me here. This day is long. You should be over there with your fan. Soon, soon. He's fine. Yeah, I have a whole table to myself. Eating fancy food at a high-class restaurant. I wonder what the surprise dish will be. Are you still making breakup songs? Do I look like I make sad, moody songs? No. Whoa, 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 what, 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 what's going on? What is wrong with you? Uh, I think that food had seafood in it, and I'm very allergic to seafood. You'll be fine. Look at the nice chicken. <laughs> what are you talking about now? There's no chicken. <laughs> Watch your mouth, chicken. Jeez, my mind is going really crazy on me right now. Fine, I'll take him to the hospital. Uh, oh boy. Whoa, what just happened? Good, you're awake. Oh, hi. 
What happened? You almost died from eating clams and drinking lemon water. No. Stay right here and I'll be back with more results. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny, but okay. Well, looks like this day is officially ruined. I guess I have to get out of the spotlight now and get a normal job. What would that look like? So if we look at our projections and statistics on the chart, we can see that. Who is doing that? It's him, Trey. Oh, what's going on? Oh, I'm sorry. Do you need a pillow? A chair with lumbar support? Maybe a juice box and crackers? Maybe a bed, a massage, a nice bath with lavender soap, and a little rubber ducky? Or do you want to pay attention, you worthless man? Um, can it be coconut soap and not lavender? He's got jokes. Well, here's one. What did the boss say to the sleeping idiot you're fired? Ha <laughs> ha, you're fired. Ha ha ha. No one likes you. Oh, no. That's not gonna happen at all. I can still save the day. Time for a hospital break. Hey, come on, we gotta go now. I have insurance. I'm not having you get hurt with me in charge, Will Even. You do have clothes on, right? Ooh, a hospital break. Fun. Hurry up. I walk slowly. No. That was so loud. Not better. Uh-oh, quick, in this closet. I thought I heard very loud, non-discreet walking. Okay, he's walking away now. Do you feel adrift? We're getting out of here right now, Mr. Guy who can't tell he's eating seafood. The clams were hidden very well. Yeah? Well, now my hands are clammy, so let's just go. Well, this is it. The end of my career. Wait, what? Why? That stupid guy online. Oh, yeah, that nails it down. He said a ton of bad things about me, and a lot of people agree with him. And now you're gonna tell everybody, oh yeah, I had the worst thing ever with Trey. I don't talk like that. Look, today was eventful. My life is uh, kind of boring, so today was different. Nice, different. Except for, you know, my allergies. And not everybody's gonna like you. You just have to accept that. Yeah, but I've been acting like a jerk all day. I promise I will change. Thanks. Mm, best day ever. I need clothes. I found the hospital boy and his kidnapper. Uh, hey, I can explain. It's a long story. I have time. Okay. I don't think this is really necessary. You can explain everything at the station. Okay, okay, just don't let this go public, please. Whatever. Oh, wait, can you stop at a fast food place? I haven't eaten. Yesterday, famous singer Trey spent an entire day with one fan, letting him experience his world. And that guy revealed how amazing the day had been with no trouble at all. Zero trouble, nothing bad at all he kept saying over and over. It looks like Trey isn't as bad as some of you think he is. Can we please talk about something actually important now? Hey everyone, Trey here. I've got to be honest for a second. Play the music. I only created a challenge to have one person spend a day with me so I could, you know, be seen as a cool guy again. Not really to hang out with the fan at all. But as the day went on, he helped me out and I realized that not everybody's gonna like me and that's fine. Oh, I hate getting mushy, but I just want to say I'm sorry. And I hope you guys can forgive me. And buy my new album. That was a joke. <laughs> that, that was a joke. Whoa, these comments are actually pretty positive. Wait, somebody asked, what's the song name that you used? Ugh. Really? That's what you took away from this? Whatever. Maybe I should do another challenge. Dude, I can't believe I won your challenge. This is crazy. Oh, no. Oh, I'm in a new song, too. It's a bop. Listen to this. I regret doing this. Here we go. It's real funky. Listen to this. When I was a boy. 